Hello guys, in this video we will see how to install PostgreSQL 16 on Ubuntu Server 24.04 but not the Ubuntu Desktop. Okay, first we will see how to install PostgreSQL on Ubuntu, then we will see how to connect PostgreSQL from Ubuntu Server and PG Admin. PG Admin is installed on Windows operating system. Okay, go to first PostgreSQL official website that is PostgreSQL.org. PostgreSQL.org. This is the official website here, PostgreSQL. Hit enter. See, at the time of making this video, PostgreSQL version is PostgreSQL 16.2. Click on download, click on Linux, then select the Ubuntu. See here, the supported versions are Noble, that is 24.04, and the least version is 20.04. Okay, we can use these commands or use these commands. So, I am going to use all these commands. Okay, so first copy this one copy it then go to ubuntu server ubuntu 24.04 server see this is the ubuntu server first connect it see i have connected to ubuntu 24.04 control l to clear screen copy this one and paste okay then provide the password of sudo user it is done. See, CA certificates and curl are already latest versions. Next command is install this PostgreSQL command. Okay. Paste it. Hit enter. Hit enter. It is done. Now next one is hit enter. It is also done. Now copy this one. Paste it. It is also done. Now update the packages. sudo apt update. See all packages are updated. Now install control L to clear screen. Now install, this is the command to install PostgreSQL. If you, if you want to install the PostgreSQL 16, you have to go hyphen 16. That, that I will show you. Go to here, sudo apt install PostgreSQL, then 16. If you want to install 16, you have to give 16. If you want to install 15, give the 15. If you want latest version available 17, give, then give 17. Okay, give 16 and hit enter. Type Y and hit enter. We have successfully installed PostgreSQL 16. Control L to create screen. Now let us connect to PostgreSQL and verify the verify the version. sudo su hyphen postgres. PSQL. See we have installed PostgreSQL 16. Let's verify the version. Select version. See we have installed PostgreSQL 16. First step after connecting to PostgreSQL server is we have to set the password for the SOAP user that is Postgres. Let us verify list of the users. Backslash du. See we have the one user that is the Postgres which is the SOAP user. So set the password for this user. Alter user Postgres with password. We have successfully set the password for the Postgres user. Let us verify list of the databases by using back, backslash and error. See, I have these three databases. Those are the default databases comes with PostgreSQL installation. Let us create a database. Create database Arthroscopes. See, we have successfully created. Let us verify. See, new database Arthroscopes is added and one is Postgres. Control L to clear screen. 
now create users create user change with password put semicolon now verify see we have created user and now if you want to switch to this new database that is art schools use the command slash e art schools okay this is the way or you can use the slash connect also both will work but we can't use the use and database this won't work in courses okay so use slash e or connect both will work let us create table in this database before that verify list of the tables see we don't have any tables create table create table student snm int snm value cat see we have created one table let us insert some data into this table insert into We have inserted two rows. Let us verify the data from this table. See, there we have two rows. If you want to see the PostgreSQL config file location, use this row config underscore file. See, this is the location that is etc PostgreSQL 16 main and PostgreSQL dot config. In the same way, if you want to find the HPA dot HPA config, so HPA underscore file. Let us exit. Now we will see how to stop, start, and restart PostgreSQL on Ubuntu server. So sudo systemctl status PostgreSQL. See, PostgreSQL is active and running. If you want to stop it, use the same sudo systemctl stop PostgreSQL. Now try to connect to it. Sudo. See, it is stopped. Let us verify the status. See, it is stopped. Okay. Now let us try to connect to PostgreSQL. Sudo su hyphen PostgreS PSQL. See, we are unable to connect it because it is stopped. Okay. Exit from this PostgreS user. Now start it. Replace this stop with start. Now verify again. See, PostgreSQL service is started. If you want to restart, just give the restart flag. Verify again. See, we have successfully restarted PostgreSQL one second ago. Control it to clear screen. Now go to PostgreSQL.com file. Even if you forgot it, sudo su hyphen PostgreS ESQL show config underscore file see this is the path etc exit now edit this one vi etc postgres equal 16 16 main postgres equal dot com scroll down listen address search for listen address See, remove the hash, replace this localhost with star, insert mode star, then save the file. After this, again modify pg underscore hpa.com, pg underscore h, scroll down, go to the bottom, shift a, hit enter, host, all all then go to where you have the pg admin i have pg admin on my local machine then check the ip ip config see this is the my ip copy it copy it. so 192.168.129.com 192 
169.132 give md5 save the file after this we have to restart the process equal sudo exit sudo systemctl restart process equal now find the ip of this machine see ip is 192.146 okay in pg admin click on servers restart then server then provide ub pg server okay name can be anything in connection name give 192 168.129.129.140 6 then click on then maintenance database postgres username postgres provide the password of postgres user click on save see we have successfully connected see these are the two databases if you create a database right click then create, create database and give me database name as pg db click on save See, new database is created. We can FA from the server also. Go to server, connect to process equal, sudo su hyphen postgres ps square, control l to ps square slash l. See, new database that is pgdb is created. Okay. So, in this video, we have seen how to install and configure process equal 16 on Ubuntu server 24.04. Then, we have seen how to connect to this process equal which is hosted on Ubuntu server from pgadmin. For more process equal or PG admin or Linux videos, please subscribe my channel. Thank you.